RFL is the most popular brand in Bangladesh. After starting its journey by producing tubewell from cast iron, RFL has spread its wings in manufacturing water pump, furniture, plastic door, PVC sheet, PVC pipe, home appliances and many more, making itself an immutable phenomena in the corporate industry today. Banking on the goodwill achieved and carrying the 20 years long experience of being in the manufacturing sector, RFL has established Rongpur Metal Industries Limited, a new benchmark in the industry. The 21,934 square kilometers factory aims to manufacture 300,000 bikes every year, making quality its first priority. The combination of high quality raw materials and the use of advanced technology has enabled RMIL to evolve as a world-class bike manufacturer under the brand umbrella of RFL. State-of-the-art technology and machineries have been used in the manufacturing process of RFL bikes. Each bike manufactured from the house of RMIL consists of steel frame, steel fork, alloy rim, steel rim, spoke and nipple, handlebar, seat post, carrier, saddle, pedal, mudguard, grip, training wheel and all other necessary parts to be compiled into a top-notch bike. Let's take a tour on how these world-class bikes are being produced at the factory of RMIL. Mitering section. The pipes are prepared according to the frame drawing. The preparation of pipes includes a set of mechanical process consisting of pipe cutting machine, swagging, doming machine, press machine, angle cutting mold, drilling machine, etc. Frame section. The prepared tubes are joined together through welding. Then the operation is completed through tagging and TIG welding. The frame then becomes ready after going through alignment balancing, rimming, filing, polishing and a thorough check from the QC. Steering tube section. First, the heading is prepared through heading machine. Afterwards, the pipes are cut and phosphated. Then those are sent to the fork section via the threads after drawing and end finishing. Fork section. In this section, the pipes are first cut before sending it through a series of operations including TIG welding, alignment balancing, bending and finally joining the pivot to it. The step is then completed by filing, polishing and a thorough check from the QC. Accessories section. Different bike accessories are prepared in this section using press machines and different modes. Handlebar section. MS pipes are cut and the end finishing is ensured. The pipes are then blown via bulging machine and polished through knurling and bending. Pre-treatment section. In this section, the materials are sent to oven after a series of chemical processes. After being QC checked, the materials are sent to the paint section. Paint section. The materials are first taken through an electrostatics paint disc and then surfaced after drying up in the oven. The same process is used to make the finishing color. The materials are varnished clearly through electrostatics paint disc 
and then sent to the assembly section via transfer conveyor after the QC check. Spoke, nipple, washer and rim are created at different individual sections before they are plated through advanced auto machine and sent to the wheel section. Over here, spokes and nipples are tightened to the rim and tires are fitted with the use of an auto machine. Finally, all the parts are assembled in the assembly line and after packaging, the bicycles are made ready for distribution. RFL holds a strong toehold as a company with over 1500 employees working dedicatedly to produce world-class bikes for the global market. RFL offers a handful number of facilities for its customers including The compliance is strictly followed at RFL as well with strict adherence to the labor law and ensuring comprehensive benefit package and security for the workers. RFL's commitment to the environment has inspired it to adopt the Go Green policy. This initiative has propelled adopting the technology of Effluent Treatment Plants ETP to stay closer to the nature. The industry also uses its own power station, hence reducing pressure on the overall demand of natural resources in the country. RFL Bike is moving on with the vision to go international. Export processing has already started for many countries. It's more of a goal than a dream for RFL that soon it will establish itself as a prominent bike brand in the world market besides holding its superiority in the local market.